Why I married my wife Tracy? Cause she wouldn't let me smash. For real, bro. I was meeting, bro. I was meeting all the baddest <laughs> chicks in the city. But when I invited her to the crib, she was like, "No, thank you." To so all the ladies out here wondering, like, "How I'ma find a good man?" Like, man, my girl ain't let me smash. You know this game is flipped upside down, right? So it's really easy to stand out these days. All you gotta do is keep your legs closed. Sounds like the bare minimum, right? But you gotta understand, we are living in a hypersexual culture. Motherfuckers is visiting pound town on the regular. So when he run across someone with self-respect, self-discipline, morals. That means you have a high standard for your life and for yourself. And you're not about to just bend your standard because you're desperate and need some company. No, she can know. So he's not about to date you. He has no option but to court you. So in this courtship stage, you are being the observer. You are paying attention to how responsible he is. His characteristics. What that integrity looking like. Is he a leader? After you've taken all your notes, right? You get to decide. You get to choose. Is it a yay or is it an A? You have the keys because you are the gatekeeper. So all you gotta do is keep your legs crossed, sit pretty, don't touch a thing, sugar, and rest in your femininity.